Hello and welcome to another exclusive roundup of reviews by me, Alex Belfield, here at CelebrityRadio.biz, the number one reviewer for theatre in the UK and Las Vegas. This week we're up in Edinburgh for music. We thought we'd bring you a selection of reviews. It seems like this is an OK show, but not amazing. Billy's back. You see, Billy Trix first appeared as the narrator in the Pet Shop Boys 2001 musical Closer to Heaven, incarnated then as now by Francis Barber. For the 2019 Fringe, the original creative team of Neil Tennant and Chris Lowe, together with scriptwriter Jonathan Harvey, have reunited to give Billy a show of her own. It's a relatively minor character, but in her own words, Billy is art. Ich bin music, opposed to Ich bin Kunst, of course, from Taboo, which means I am art. There was many Ich bin Kunst this year at Edinburgh. Everyone agrees that Billy Trix was mesmerising. I'm a gift to the world, she says repeatedly, and you believe it. This show is to be her telling of her own story, and the more juicy and sensational the better. It's open heart surgery, so pass me the knife. They say the songs aren't bad and Harvey's script is racy, sharp and well observed. Less impressed by music at the Edinburgh Fringe was the Daily Telegraph who say Elton John and Boy George were among the VIPs at the opening night in 2001. Anticipation levels were high, Neil Tennant and Chris Lowe being the most successful British pop duo of all time. But responses were mixed, to say the least, to their musical. The broad criticism was that the dialogue was flat, the characterisation was thin, and some of the songs on the dead parrot side. This word magnetic must be in a press release somewhere because iNews have used it as well. They say it's a magnetic new show, but only three stars. Music has been described as the new Pet Shop Boys musical, which isn't entirely untrue, as it features six new songs by Britain's smartest and most popular, culturally astute electro-pop group, and is technically a follow-up to Neil Tennant and Chris Lowe's 2001 musical Closer to Heaven. Yet those expecting a celebration of the Pet Shop Boys music and career might be disappointed. I think this seems to be the consensus that they wanted more of a jukebox musical to celebrate their iconic musical heritage than a new piece of work. The Evening Standard seem a little bit more impressed. They gave it four stars and said, Francis Barber, Jonathan Harvey and the Pet Shop Boys is a tasty combo to savour and music is definitely the sum of its parts. Witty, easy on the ears and as camp as a row of scouts. Guardian 2 rather liked it. They gave it four stars too. It evokes Warhol, Dali and Nico, they say. So nobody's saying it's a five-star mega musical. Most people agree it's a three-star OK musical. Let's see how it reincarnates to get into the West End or on tour and whether they change it up or stick with the format. Seems to me most people want the hits of the Pet Shop Boys, not an original piece, which is surprising. Of course, it must be said that in Edinburgh, you don't often get the full show and nobody's doubting that Francis Barber's portrayal of the part is quite brilliant. You've been listening to another disappointing review by me, Alex Belfield, here at CelebrityRadio.biz, where last year we had over 12 million minutes viewed on YouTube. You can check out all of our hundreds of interviews and reviews at www.celebrityradio.biz. Tenor.